Hello folks, welcome back to Let's Play Might and Magic 6, part 29. Uh, we left off last time with this chest blowing us up and killing us, and then we have this room we gotta clear. Um, it is 11.34 in the game. We, we have a few hours of in-game time. And I think what I should do is, is run out, uh, heal up, let's clear out that last room down there see where that puts us and then maybe take a crack at the chest or take a crack at the chest when we're fresh so it's not gonna you know instantly kill us um because it's probably got some valuable stuff in it so i'd like to get that before we leave as for that basement filled with ghosts <clears throat> um we may or may not need to go down in that room and i have a hunch we have to come back here anyways because uh, I'm failing to remember what Colgan's estate quest is for. So, six in the game, which I was supposed to look at off-screen. Uh, recording from the past four videos was yesterday, uh, Sunday. Today's Monday in the morning. Took care of some stuff around the house, and I dove right in, giving the full the full feel here. And I think that's okay considering. Okay, I, I vaguely remember. Not, not vaguely, I think I remember pretty good what I was doing. It's not like before where I took uh, six months off in between videos. But sometimes you just gotta do that, right? Like, you gotta go take care of life. Now we're just gonna hammer these out. Okay. So looks like I did open that room. Or right now there's moving. No, I opened it, okay. So let's. See if you're pulling out. Good. It's just a ghost, so. With these long hallways, I might, yeah, see, I might be able to just back up and shoot. Your recovery time slows when you're moving. I don't know. Aha. Uh -huh. Poison resistance, that's not bad. Yeah, your recovery time slows when you're moving. But with these long hallways, we got plenty of time to take shots. And you can see they kind of get stunned a little bit, but what we don't have is time to line up the fireball. And we definitely want, there's three of them there, so let's, let's head way back and see if we can cast a couple of those. Fireballs are worth the run, right? There we go. I feel like even our characters got some sleep. It was the end of a long day when I was recording the last ones. Uh, I do apologize for being a little, little quiet. I do like to be into the action, into the fray. That's what we're here for. Okay, anymore? No. Okay, so we have a chest. And no buttons or anything, so we'll save here. Uh, I blast. Uh, Protection from cold. Uh, Ring of health, not bad. We'll put that on somebody. What do you have for rings? You just have one, so put that there. That was a very not so dramatic room. I, I thought there was like a button in here, but I'm not seeing one. And I want to take a crack at this one one more time. Hey, there we go. Uh oh. Okay, we had a letter. Colligan's diary. Aha. Uh -huh. Fancy had a mighty, not bad. A uh, yellow potion. We'll put that there for now. She, he's full. I think she's full, but she's holding everything. I don't know. I don't know. Too bad we just bought those bows. Let's heal her up. That. Uh, with the bows, even though I had bought them, you want to check them just to see if there's any plus damage. What I can't see I don't know. is if they have any elemental damage on them. So I should probably get that identified still. We'll put that there. Uh, page from Corlegan's Diary. Corlegan. Also, hold on. Let me head off screen here for a second. No, I don't want to open up Snipping Tool. I want to open up Sticky Notes. There we go. And we can delete this note. 
Core Lagon. There we go. I think I had that spelled wrong on my video, but that hasn't uploaded yet, so I'll edit that before you folks see it. This is your note that I can't spell. Let's read the letter. Hmm. <clears throat> my studies with the Crystal of Terax have grown tiring. I don't think I grasp enough of the basic magics to fully understand the lessons of the crystal. My time is growing short here, and I think I will be forced to continue my studies as a lich. I refuse to let go of and embrace death, not after my failure in the succession wars and my failures in learning magic. I'll use the time I gain from Lichdom to train myself more fully in magic and plot my revenge on the Iron Fists for what they've done to Archibald and myself. <clears throat> Very cool. So, it's a letter. Um, just hold our notes right now. He is. That's pretty cool, because... Um, I'm saying that a lot. i got to work on not saying that. So... Playing D and D as a wizard very recently, actually. I will be playing on Saturday some more. We're playing roughly every two weeks. It's fun. And pause that thought. Let uh, one eighteen in the game. We have a few hours before we need to walk. I want to get there in the morning with daylight because we're gonna be running around. So I'm gonna heal up and see if we can take out some of those ghosts. Back to where I was. Playing as a wizard. One of the classic tropes of a wizard is to become a lich. Now, I don't remember where it started. I believe it was D&D. Um, I don't say that, so I'm trying to work on it. Uh, the, the Vecna. Vecna. Oh, 5 a.m. to 1 a.m. Damn it. So, we're kind of SOL. We could rest, but if 8 hours to heal would not be enough. Well, we should do that. See if we can catch the inn. That inn closes at two. This can be really close. So Vecna was similar to that, and Vecna's teacher was it. I think it begins with an A. I'm not the most familiar with D and D lore. Hello. Oh my gosh, we just caught that. Whew. So okay, I'll save. Hello, come okay, on. just in case I miss the day. I don't think I will, but enjoy your stay. Nice. Sunday, 601. So we slept for three hours and fully healed. Let's turn base just to finish that thought. So Vecna and Vecna's teacher's name, I believe, I believe because of A, were very powerful wizards that became liches. And that's old school D&D. Would have been 80s, I believe. Definitely the 80s. Because I think came out with Great Hawk, and I'm pretty sure that was 80s. So, this is before me. I'm 29. I was not before. I was not there for this, but the concept of a wizard becoming a lich to give themselves more time to learn magic is quite fitting. That, that chase for power. It's something you see across a few games. Okay. I also have a second. I'm going to press turn based mode again. Actually, I'll just enter my menu here. Let's open up the one note over here. Go back to my tab. The root. So we need to go straight to the well, then to the stables. That's really all we need to do here. We're timing the well. So let's go to our stats. This should be the well of endurance. So endurance is at 11. Ashes max. Leola is at 11. 11, 11. So we need two drinks each, plus two, plus two, plus two. Two, two is four, so 15 is the max. And the well gives seven to eight, so there's plenty there. Which will 
max the endurance. Then we go to white cap and we get the shrine. Accuracy is back over here. Accuracy was in Silver Cove. And that will be the next shrine. If you notice, they're going in order. So we'll have a bunch from then to get to Silver Cove, which is right next door. Should just get two drakes on Aristus and Leola. From there, we are all done with the wells. Then we hit the shrines, and we can do the black potions, and we can do the hidden thing. Roughly six months into the game, just to do this on the stats points basis. You do not need to do this if you're speed running. So this part's gonna be a little busy. I should want to start here because I want to go and hit fly. Ready, folks? And our ghosts and harpies can fly. There's a lot of skeletons and ghosts in my the damned. We're running straight for the well. The well is right about here. My biggest fear with this is running into a harpy, harpy something. And I'm not sure if we'll see them, but it's gonna be a blue or red one. Harpy wish. I, I think it's the red ones, but it might be the wishes. They can curse you from a distance. Okay. Not oh, like that. They can also so, enter there. When it's the character's turn, we'll drink twice. Okay. Now we'll just pop off a shot. Doesn't matter. We'll take a few hits. It's alright. Okay. Look at the faces for them being cursed. It's crazy. We have three minutes left in fly. We want to... Up there... The curse hurts, but wish we could move. Now we just want to get to town. I'm gonna to try to cast. It's probably not gonna work. Oh, it did work! Wow, that was lucky. It was when you're cursed, you have 50% chance to have your spell fail. We're heading straight for the town, which is up here. The town is swarming with skeletons. And we're pulling ghosts with us. Let's pause right here before the skeletons start moving and the ghosts in town. I'm gonna pause, I'll be way back. I just wanna double check before I move to make sure that there's nothing else in town that I need. Okay, and we're back. Having checked it, really, we can hit the shops, but without remove curse, we're kind of cursed. Ha ha ha, no pun intended. This, this place is tough without remove cursed because of what's in the area. If you come down here, there's a Temple of Bob that can heal you, so you could use that as a point and fight out some here, but we already have the stables, which are right here lined up for us. What I do want are the horseshoes and the stables. If I could hit the Alchemist Shop, that'd be good. So. myself in the right spot. I think the horses are actually outside of this little spot. This little wall gives us some some shielding though. And you want to be careful with arrows in here. There are townsfolk mixed in. It's really annoying. Being cursed means 50% of your spells will fail. Though she seems to be champing right through it. I think it's adding age to our character. Yeah. Yeah. 
I used to think of H just like, oh, it's just a number. <laughs> no, no cliche intended. However, imagine you age up one year right now. Just think, think, going back one year, everything you felt that one year hitting you all at once. What would that feel like? I'm talking every, every new ache and pain. Sword being sideways is very, very neat. Every everything you felt from normal aging. Let's just keep it at that. Not the events that happen because obviously the events don't happen. But your organ aging a year per organ, your brain. Oh goodness. They are taking swings at me. I think it might be this one. I don't think it's that one. If we can get this town clear, because it's only 7 to 17, and this is the stables. So, we have some time. See, see how he's mixed right in? Like, Brandon, get out of here. So I can't use AoE spells. A fireball would destroy my reputation. And if I quick shoot at this one, it could hit the one behind him. Like, go away. We're not in combat. Oh, the, the one shot, not good. Ah, save the cure wounds. I gotta get this specter dropped. You all know what I should be using here, right? Bless. They seem to be gumming up the door, though. This is really cool. It's really good for us. Let me back up for a second. Okay, they're both swinging, so... I guess this wall really doesn't protect us. There's the failure. Spell failed again. Spell failed again. Help. Four in a row. I don't know. Five healing spells. Are afraid. We're okay with that. Okay, we got a, we got a heal. I might have to use some potions here. Another specter too. That's not good. The thing is, it's only 10 hit points. So, like, using those potions just, it doesn't feel good. So it worked. Success. I broke her armor, of course. Oh. 
How swarmed are we? We're pretty swarmed. Right now what I'm trying to do is fight my way out to get into the town. But I don't know if we're going to have it. That's good. I wish he had some type of a healing spell. There we go. We found a ring. I'm doing this way for another reason too. I want a door. So like, if I do this. If I move here, this, which I just probably should have done. Are they too far away now? And are they too far away now? Someone heal me. I think that worked. This is what I should have done to start with. I don't actually I shoot him at one. Freaking Brandon the Psychic over here has been in the way the entire conflict. Not that I was going to be fireballing with them all in my face. There's uh, quite a bit of potions here. But we'll buy some more. I think having access to a day in town will be good for us. don't seem that dramatic, but what are they feeling? You have no spell points. It worked. There we go. That gave us that was a good round. Brandon, fucking hey dude. So many spell failures. There we go, that was good. And that was not good. Success. Someone heal me.
We might be good. Help! Might is a strong word. And might magic. Yeah, as long as as long as they stay on the right side here. Oh yeah. Look at that. We really should have backed up at first. It's not working out. They have to be they have to be like close to us. I'm using these herbs because I don't. Well, I don't want to remember what bottles I have over there. I should take a picture. Are you kidding me? Success. That ghost like took a whole round of combat, and we're really close. knocks her right out. I'm out of bottles. So now we start taking the reds. We just gotta remember that we're missing reds from here. say here comes that specter this is going to be you watch this one character is going to be the break you have six spell points spell fail i probably should just shoot or swing with her i need a really good round that was it Because we can't, like, just come back here. And I gave that to the wrong person. All right. I was hoping. That was a good fight, but I, I think we got to go. Need a ride? Ash is in no condition, so we got to pay the full price. Yeah, because we have two characters. He's not even hurt. We cleared off a bunch of them, but I was hoping to be able to run out and around and do some stuff here. Like, let me look at this. You know, we have enough. We'd have to waste a lot of bottles. Like, is that worth it to run out and get some gold and some horseshoes? Let me pause. I'll be right back. I'm going to do some math. Okay, so it would be... My thought was to make a rejuvenation potion. Or, uh, I think that's the one. No, sorry. Uh, Divine Cure. It's plus 100 hit points and plus one year to age. But I th I'm looking at it. And I think that it doesn't heal that many hit points. I think what it does is it adds that to your pool. I could be wrong. It's an orange and a restoration. So you would end up with like using a lot of the reds that we already used up. And I don't think it would even heal it. So I think unfortunately that's that is that for the spot for right now. We we did the stable fixing and we go to Free Haven. Hitch up the horses. And we will heal up and continue on next time. Uh, thank you folks for joining me. That was part 29. Next time is part 30. Goodness gracious. We are we are on our way. It is Wednesday the 10th of April. And we're gonna we're gonna get that shrine in time. Which is great. The wells were hit. So like our primary mission, self-set, on getting the stats. It's still going according to plan, based, based on the wells, which I think is unique.
And I like that. Uh, but anyways, you folks take care. We'll see you next time. Don't forget to drop a like, a comment, subscribe maybe. Let me know what you think. Questions, comments, concerns, constructive criticism. Oh my goodness. And we'll work on the ums. Y'all take care. Happy gaming.